A controversial casino draws a crowd to Portland tonight. K2Z Teachout is here with the latest on the pros and cons of a casino in the gorge. What'd you hear, Ed? Well, Steve, since the casino is proposed to be built near a federally protected area, public testimony has to be taken. We found few people attending tonight's meeting who hadn't already taken a side in this latest casino controversy. So I urge you to participate in this process. The process is to get your opinion on whether a casino should be built at Cascade Locks. We definitely, we're definitely against it. These so-called open houses are being held at different locations, so everyone has a chance to see the plan and comment. At this third meeting in Portland, we found lots of folks against a casino. We're losing that scenic beauty, and you know we have a lot of development already going on. I'm concerned about increased highway traffic, which would generate more pollution in the gorge. The tribes have got a paradise of 600 and some acres in Warm Springs. If they must have a casino to better themselves, build it there. The Confederated Tribes of Warm Springs want to build a $300 million casino facility on this 25 acres in Cascade Locks. Last April, the tribes got the backing of Oregon's governor. Last week, we heard lots of supporters at a similar open house in the gorge. I don't see any down part as far as environmental with the extra traffic here. Back in Portland, we did find a few casino supporters. And the gorge itself is not Grand Canyon. It is not Yellowstone. It is not Yosemite. It's an area that we need economically through there. Organizers insist they're not taking votes, but it's getting more difficult to find folks at these open houses who haven't already made up their mind. Are you in favor of this? No. Do you know anybody here that is? Um, no. no? Not he's like a normal person. The final two open houses are both in the gorge and at Hood River and Stevenson. A decision on the casino isn't expected until next summer. Steve? I know you'll be following it as well, Ed. Thank you very much. We've learned what's...